YouTube. What's up, baby? It's your boy, DMD, man. And as you see from the title already, man, I'm about to give y'all my top, I think I got 20 or 30 shoes on this list of all the shoes that I took the L in this year, man. Yo, we all was not able to cop every single shoe that we wanted in 2016. And 2016 was definitely a dope year for the sneaker community they had a lot of collabs it, it was just a lot of dope shoes that came out other than jordans and yeezys there's a lot of other dope shoes that i struck out on for numerous reasons um it doesn't matter if uh i overslept or i just wasn't able to cop or my phone was tripping the internet connection was bad when i was trying to log in to my account or the uh sneaker app crashed or whatever reason man i just took an l and i was not able to cop these shoes i think it was 30 shoes that i'm listing right now i really don't know how many shoes i picked out i just picked out all the shoes that i was not able to cop this year that i really wanted so up here i'm gonna have pictures and i'm gonna have some numbers listing exactly where and what number the shoes is coming down on the list so i got my laptop right here so let's just get straight into it, man, because I don't want to make this video too, 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 too long because I got a lot of shoes to talk about. So I'm just going to talk about each shoe very briefly and just run to the next one. All right. So let's just get straight into it, man. <laughs> when this shoe first came out. Oh, my God. I fell in love with this shoe, man. With the LeBrons, man. <laughs> These LeBron 13s. I was... I love this shoe, man. Like, this shoe, I knew it was going to sell out. And every time they came out with new colorways, they just sold out so fast. I wasn't able to cop any. You know, like, this is my favorite player in the world. Forget Michael Jordan that, that, that won six rings and never lost a championship. Forget Kobe Bryant that won five rings. I love LeBron. LeBron's the GOAT. He's the best three-quarter player of all time. And I was never able to cop these 13s. You know, LeBron James stuffed the stat sheets in the first three quarters. He's the best of all time. But in the fourth quarter, he relies on other players because he's such a good all-around basketball player and he's so unshut he's so unselfish but um yeah LeBron 13s man I wasn't able to cop any because they sold out so fast But anyway, back to the original video. Let's go. Um, the first shoe that I'm gonna talk about are, bam, these Harachis, man. Yo, I love these Harachis. I love this silhouette, just that olive green, and it's just, it's just all olive green. Normally, Harachis, like, they have, like, olive green, and then they have a white bottom, or, like, a white sole, or a black sole, but I just love this, and, this is one of the shoes that I thought was gonna go on sale, but my method backfired on me and I waited too long and it just sold out. And I've been, I, I've been trying to search for this shoe for so long because these Harachis are the ultimate Harachis. So they are ultimate comfortable, ultimate dope, and they just look very, very dope on feet. So I wasn't able to cop these, but I just love these, man. Just check out the pictures on here, man. Very dope on foot. And this is just a casual shoe that you can wear anytime, anywhere, any place, and look fly and be comfortable. So we're gonna move right along, man. The next shoe that I took an L on was these uh, Vans right here. Yo, these Vans right here, I slipped on these. I ain't gonna lie. I slipped on these. I wasn't even thinking about these vans at the time, but maybe like a week after 
Um, I think I seen some random YouTuber just talk about these shoes. I was like, damn, those are pretty dope. But the ones that I like are these right here. I think these are the Andes. Um, I actually seen this in person when I went to the mall one day, but they did not have my size. But the leather on these bad boys is nice. They nice. And like, I just love this whole brown, uh, cocoa, peanut butter type of material. Like, I feel like you can wear this shoe with anything casual. You can dress up, you can dress down. It's just really dope, man. And I love Toy Story. Like, I was born when this movie was out. You know what I'm saying? So, I remember going to the movies and watching this and Andy and all the motherfucker, Buzz Lightyear, Buzz, Buzz Lightyear and all the motherfuckers. So, I remember, I remember this movie and I love this shoe, but I, I slipped. I ain't gonna lie, I slipped on it. And uh, I just waited too late and now I can't find this shoe nowhere. So I'm ass out on this shoe. So we moving right along, man. Like I said, I'm just gonna speed through this because I know I got a lot of shoes to talk about. So we gonna move on into these Wale's. Man, another shoe that I, I slipped on these. I ain't gonna lie. A lot of these shoes I slipped on because I was thinking, okay, ain't nobody really checking for these shoes. You know what I mean? But Sometimes my method work, sometimes it don't. And in this case, my method did not work, man. I love this Tiffany green, man. I don't care what nobody say. These are dope. Do you see these on the screen? Like, come on, man. Like, like this is fly right here. And this is a unique color that is on a Timberland. Like, you're, we, we are probably never gonna see this colorway on a Timberland. And then, and then it got that, um, 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 like that gum bottom at the bottom right there. And I haven't seen these in person, but from the pictures, this look like they got some premium, premium material on here. So this is a Timberland that I'm definitely mad about that I did not cop when it first released. And uh, we gonna move right along, baby. So up next we got, um, which one am I gonna pick next? Uh, goddamn. Ah, uh, okay. We're gonna pick these right here, man. Um, these bad boys. The reason why I didn't pick these, these Prestos, because, um, oh, my fucking internet on my phone was not working at the time. Like, I was checking out for these shoes for a long time. Like, I love Prestos. They're very comfortable. They're very stylish. And the whole what the theme, I love when Nike just mix all different colors and materials and just throws it all together. It just makes it look crazy. You know, definitely like an eye catcher type shoe when you wear it out in public. But I was not able to cop these because my phone was tripping at the last minute. Like it was like 8.59 and it dropped at nine o'clock. And then like my internet was tripping. The damn application wouldn't let me log into my account. And by the time my internet was working and I logged in, the shit was gone. And like now, I mean, I can still find it for, for retail. I mean, for a resale, but I'm not about to pay two, $250 for these. So, you know, if I don't come up on a good, you know, price for these, um, I'm not going to buy them, but I, I do like them. I'm still on the hunt for these and those are dope, man. So, boom, we're going to move right along. Since we, since I'm talking about Prestos, let's talk about these bad boys. I don't even know the name of these motherfuckers, but these, these are different. Very, very, very different. Um, I think the name of these are the Nike Lab L Prestos or some shit, I don't know. But this shoe is funky and it's crazy and it's wild and it's just a whole bunch of colors that don't mix. So the only thing that you can probably wear with this is like maybe some black sweatpants or some black jeans or some black whatever joggers or whatever but this shoe right here is dope and it's crazy and, and it's just it's just it's just weird and i like that about this shoe man so i wasn't able to cop this shoe this is a shoe that i slept on and then i realized damn that was a dope shoe but by the time i liked i actually liked the shoe it was gone it was just gone so yeah that's another presto that i slept on that i wish i had in my collection so we're gonna move along man we're gonna move along to these right here. These are definitely sleepers. And I definitely slept on this. Um, this is a very affordable shoe. These top 10 Adidas uh, camo, very, very dope. I think these are only like $90. Um, 
I can actually buy this shoe right now, but I don't want to buy this shoe because it doesn't have my size. Like I'm a size 11 and I don't know if I want to go wear a size 11 and a half in these because these are already bulky and big. So I just like, I can buy it right now, but I just don't want that size. But this is definitely a dope shoe, man. I love Adidas. The original Adidas, the top tens, the Stan Smith, the Shell Toes, that's my style of Adidas. Not all this NMD Yeezy boost and all that shit. It's cool. Hey, if you like it, I love it. But this is this is the Adidas that I like. So I can't buy it, but it's not my shoe size. So I'm just gonna pass on these and maybe in the, in the, in the future, I'll, I'll be able to get my size, man. So we gonna move right along. I'm gonna go straight through this with no editing. So I'm, I'm just gonna burn straight through this. This is no editing. Raw, uncut, no condom. Let's go. All right, so the next shoe that I'm gonna pick is, uh, what shoes am I gonna pick? What shoes am I, oh, these right here. These Jordan 10 uh, uh, Paris. Um, I wasn't able to cop these. Well, a lot of people wasn't able to cop these because this was a Europe release. If I'm not mistaken, you can only buy this in Europe or I don't know, overseas. All right, overseas. But this is definitely a nice color, man. I love purple, man. Purple is, it's starting to creep up on me. Like, I like the way, I don't know what material this is. This is, this looks like, I don't know, like the shoe got pimples or something like herpes like purple herpes all over the damn shoe which is dope though i i, I think it i think it looks nice especially the bottom the sole on these is is what got me because it got that translucent then that purple like i think this shoe is really really dope i, I don't know if y'all like it but i like this shoe and hopefully i'll be able to cop this in the near future for retail because yeah, I ain't I ain't about that resale. So this is a, another shoe that I was not able to cop because it was just overseas. So I just, I, I don't have no overseas connection. You know what I'm saying? But it, if I do have some overseas followers, holla at your boy. You know what I'm saying? Send me an email and we can talk. You know what I'm saying? All right, but we're going to get straight into this, man. Um, The next shoe that I'm going to talk about are these Harachis. All right, so I talked about the olive green Harachis, but these... I was actually trying to get, man, but once again, my phone was acting up. I didn't have internet connection when this shoe dropped. And by the time the internet was working, my size was gone. Because in Harachis, I go uh, full size up. I'm a size 11, but in Harachis, I gotta wear a size 12 because they run snug as fuck. But these bad boys, whoo, that blue suede is pretty. Me, yum! Like this is a dope ass shoe. And then on the heel, you got that. I think these are, are like the low riders. So that heel that you see right there is supposed to be like a metal reflective, kind of like a gas exhaust pipe type of thing. Like this whole theme is dope. And then you got the white bottom. But I just really like that blue. That blue is popping. That blue is 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 just standing out. It looks premium. So. Hopefully I can cop these in the future too and uh, I don't have to pay crazy resale prices. But all these shoes that I'm listing, I am gonna still try to get them, but I just don't wanna pay cr crazy resale prices. So I'm just gonna be patient and hopefully I can run up on somebody that's, you know, that's cool people that wanna look out for me, you know what I mean? But anyway, we can go straight into, uh, I don't even know what, what number I'm on. I'm just scrolling through my, uh, my goddamn uh, computer. Oh, all right. Let's get on these Kyrie's real quick. Let's get on these Kyrie's. Wow, as you see right there, I don't know the name of this shoe. I think this is called like the Lava or something. I don't know, but red is my favorite color. And I like this red on this shoe. Like it just pops. It's, it's a very popping shoe. Like I feel like if you wear this shoe, everybody's gonna be looking at you because you're gonna be looking like you like walking in lava. I don't know, but the shit popping though. But um, yeah, I slept on this shoe. I did find this shoe for under retail, but they didn't have my size. So all, all the size that was available was like a size 10 or, or whatever. But in Kyrie's, I gotta go a half size up. So I get 11 and a half and they didn't have my size. So um, I'm still gonna be looking out for those, but another Kyrie that I missed out that I did want to buy was, whoo, man. These bad boys right here, the Wonders, 
those are dope but once again it's just an overseas release and um you know i just i'm just not able to to cop them like i, I love this color i like how nike didn't go with the whole crazy theme for the what this they made it one color which is dope but they made different material on the shoe so every like like the strap is different from the heel the heel is different from the toe the toe is different from the bottom it's like a lot of different materials that they just threw in one but this color is dope the white ones i'm schlade but this one this this kind of a tiffany green light green whatever green you want to call it is dope as fuck and you know maybe if i got some out of town subscribers holla at your boy man Holla at your boy, cause I need these. Size 11, hit me up. Damn D, no, D-E-E -E Wilson at yahoo.com. You know what I'm saying? Hit me up. All right, so we gonna move straight along, straight along, straight along. Oh yeah, man. Let me get into these Kobe's, man. Oh, I'm mad I did not make this Nike ID, man. These Kobe 10s, the Grinch. I'm so mad I did not make this ID. I don't know why I, I didn't. I think I did make this ID, but I waited too long to make the purchase. Like it was in my, it was in my um cart and I made it and everything. But I think I just waited too long. And you know with these Nike IDs, you got a time frame to, to, to actually place the order. And I think for these, I just waited too damn long. But man, I just love this popping, this this green, that that Grinch green with the red shoelaces. Very dope, very dope, so, yeah. Since we talking about Kobe's, uh, I'm mad that I slipped on these. I was not expecting this shoe to sell out online, and they sold out pretty damn fast, man. These Kobe 11 uh, Ghost Christmas theme of Celebration Station Easter Bunny, I don't know, something like that. But these came out j just recently, and I love this shoe, man. This colorway is dope. I like bright colors, so this shoe I will wear at the gym while I'm working out. So, and this is like a very detailed shoe. Like, if you actually look at the images that I got right here, they're very dope. But I didn't think people was actually checking for this shoe. So I was like, I'm asleep and wait till this shoe go on sale. But my method backfired on me and yeah, these sold out. So hopefully I can just go to a store maybe and they have these, but online, like they pretty much sold out, man. They gone, cool. So, uh, shit, man, I'm just moving right along. My, hold on, let me check real quick, see if this battery, <laughs> see if this camera's still recording. Okay, yep, yeah, it's still recording. All right, let me, hey, like I said, this is raw uncut, so I'm gonna just go straight through this, all right? So, what, what other shoe did I, da 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 All right, I talked about those, I talked about those, I talked about those, I talked about those, I talked about those. Okay, boom, right here, man. This is another release that you cannot get overseas, that you can only get overseas, are these Jordan. What are these? Chinese single day or something like that? <laughs> I gotta get my hands on these somehow, some way, man, because red is my favorite color. Red is my, red is my favorite color, man, and this, Jordan 13s, I love Jordan 13s, and this is just like, woo, like, if you get this shoe, ain't nobody in America is gonna have these, like, if you wear these, you're gonna be killing the game, because ain't nobody gonna have them, nobody gonna have them, and this is dope, I don't know how the material is on this shoe, but from the images, man, these, these holes look like, it's like made from some good material, just that all red, I don't know if that suede or what, but, and then they got that black, and um, I think like on the on the on the side panel, that black actually rubs off. You know what I mean? And it and it turns into something else. So that makes the shoe even doper. But that that rubbed off feature looks kind of stupid. So I I would rub it off if I had the shoe. But this man, this red, this black and red. I love red. I love Joy 13s, and this is exclusive. So if I got some Chinese um followers, you know, Japan. We, Wherever you live, and you can get this, holla at your boy, man. D-E-E -E Wilson, zero, zero, I need a size 11, holla at your boy. Let's talk, all right? So we're gonna get straight into the next one. Oh, and I like those, um, these two. These actually came out 
it was like a package. Uh, I don't know what color you call this, Tiffany green, nil, teal, whatever, but this is dope too. I think this is only in women's. You can only get this in women's size, but from this picture, as you see right there, it looked like that's some really tumbled soft leather. So that's a very dope shoe for the ladies. Ladies, y'all better not sleep on this shoe. Whatever, come pretty screen right here and the picture right there. These are dope, so ladies, y'all need to hop on that ASAP, Rocky ASAP. All right, I I'm think I'm moving, I think, I think we're moving along to like my next, I, I think I only have five shoes left on here that, uh, that I picked out. So I don't know where, what number I'm on, on the screen, it's gonna show what number I'm on, but we just gonna straight into it. So my list is not in a particular order because I don't know how many shoes I picked, but these last few shoes are the shoes that I really wanted, that I slept on, or I just wasn't able to buy. So we gonna move into these fours. These, whoo, these fours, the only reason why I didn't buy this because of the price. The price, $400? <sighs> I'm so, so like, like if I can spend four hundred dollars, I gotta really, 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 really love this shoe. Like those gingers, like those, I felt like was 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 worth four hundred dollars. But these, I seen these in person when I was in Chicago, and they are, oh, they are very, very, very nice. Like the material, I don't know what type of material they use, but it looks like a Versace couch wrapped around a baby lion just chilling on a cut with like pillow, blue pillow from the heavens with like violin strings from Jamaica and like the, I don't know, this this just looks clean. Like that blue is very dope. I love the white so Maybe if I can get this for like $300, I maybe pull that trigger. But um, yeah, just that 400 price point was just like, uh, like maybe I just catch this on a slick slide if somebody, you know, if they go on sale somehow, some way. But these fours are definitely dope. And Jordan 4s is my favorite silhouette, if you don't know. Now you know. So we're gonna move straight along since we're talking about Jordans. Uh, we're gonna talk about these. These 12s. Now these I thought was gonna go on sale. Like, I thought these were gonna go on sale. Y'all know my method. Um, be patient and the shoe will go on sale. And for a little while, it looked like this shoe was gonna go on sale because wasn't nobody really buying it. It sat on shelves for a while, but I think they sold out just right on time before they sold out, before they got on sale. I think these shoes sold out right before the shoe was about to go on sale because I don't see this shoe nowhere. I've been looking everywhere to see if this shoe was gonna go on sale on websites. They all sold out at retail prices. So my method of being patient backfired on me on this shoe. You know, it happens sometimes, you know what I mean? You win some and you lose some. So on this one I lost and uh, maybe if I can get this for retail or a little bit under retail, I'll pull that trigger. But I definitely like this 12 and um, you know, I slept too long. I slept too long. But uh, we're gonna move right along. I think this is my top three or four. I don't know. Um, yeah, there were two foams that I struck out this year. I, I pretty much got all the foams that I wanted, but I did not get these two. The mirror blue foams. Oh. Just, dude, it's, it's, it's dope. It's dope. I mean, there's nothing more to say. You see the pictures. They just dope, man, and, and I just wasn't able to copy because they sold out so fast. I didn't win in a raffle. Like, I just wasn't able to copy. So, yeah, I just I just took an L on this one. And these, the Northern Lights, I'm not gonna lie, I slept on these. I didn't, I didn't think people were gonna be checking out for these like they was, and these sold out fast. Like, real fast. Like, some... <sighs> Sometimes I can predict shoes if they're gonna sell out or not, but sometimes I'm wrong. And this shoe, I thought people wasn't gonna be checking for, but they did and they sold out and I can't find these nowhere for retail. People trying to charge 350 for these. Bro, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not about to pay 350 for these goddamn shoes. But these are dope, I, I love that colorway. Um, for once, they actually got the, 
sole right. Instead of putting a, a clear sole, they put the black sole on it, which matches the leather on top. So this is dope, man. So I'm still on the, on the, on the lookout for these. Hold on, let me make sure my camera's still rolling. Uh, is it still rolling? Yep, it's still rolling. Okay, good. Let me speed this up before my camera just shuts off. Um, now we're moving on. I think for the top three. I don't know. So I don't know. I, I think. Let me let me let me scroll through this real quick. I talked about that. Talked about that. Talked about that. Yeah, we got one, two. Um, we got three. We got four. We got. Yeah, we got four shoes left. So these are my top four shoes that I have that were I that I took an L on. So we gonna get into um, goddamn, which one did I pick? All right, these these Jordan Elevens. Well, the only reason that I wasn't able to get these Jordan Elevens because they only came in mini sizes in GS sizes. They came in extended sizes, but it was my feet too big for the size that um. For the biggest extended sizes but these are dope very very dope i was able to see these in, see these in person and the material they nice very they, mm, mm, meatball nice very meatball nice what the hell does that mean <laughs> but it's they they're very nice so ladies i hope y'all did not sleep on these 11s because these 11s are probably like the dopest women's shoe that ever came out like these these are up there with like the top 11s of all time in in my opinion like this is dope so um yeah we're gonna move straight along and we're gonna move into the i slept hard on these shoes i slept hard like i was in slumber because when i first seen this picture i was like man that's that's just too much gold like damn like when and how am I gonna wear this shoe? Like I was, I slept on it hard. I was like, I'm not about to go for these. I should have bought them. I should have bought them, man. Cause I seen somebody in person in these. Ooh, woo! Them hoes is <laughs> they nice, man. They nice. If I could come. If I can come across a good price on these, maybe a little bit over retail, I will pull that trigger, man. These are very, very nice, man. Those all gold premium sixes, man. Very, very dope, man. I slept so I slept so hard on these, man, and I regret not buying this shoe, man. So I just took the L on these because I just slept. I, 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 I slept extra hard on these. But I will get these in the future, you know what I mean? I just gotta be patient. Just gotta be patient, you know what I mean? All these shoes that I listed, I feel like I'm I'm gonna get eventually, you know, eventually, you know what I mean? So that's just a part of the game. So we down to the last two shoes, the last two shoes. And this one, well actually three, three, I lied, three shoes. <laughs> um, We're just gonna go into these, the wings, the Jordan 12 wings, man, these are very very dope a lot of people think this shoe is basic because it looks like the playoff 12s it, it does at the same time but it doesn't at the same time like the material is completely different you got gold strips here you got gold strips there and as we all know um the black panel or the leather or whatever material that is that wipes away and you got gold wings all over the shoe. I don't know about y'all, but I think that's dope. I seen pictures with the uh, with the black stripped off with, with just the gold prints. I would wear my shoes like that. Like if I was able to uh, buy these shoes, I would strip all that black off and I would wear my shoes with the wings showing because that to me is just crazy, crazy dope. So yeah, these right here, I just took the L on because these were hard to get. Very limited, very hard to get on that on the application and uh yeah i just struck out on these i just struck out so we move it right along to um yeah another shoe another jordan 12 this is probably the only two shoes that are hyped up that are hype beast shoes 
was the wing twirls that I talked about, and these, the OVOs. Um, I don't care if it's hyped. These are nice. <laughs> these are clean, very plush, very like elegant. Like that white, just I don't know. It just pearls at you. Like in the in the material, it's like stingray nuts and like octopus legs and just like it's just dope like i don't know what the fuck material that is but that white and that gold like the whole ovo color scheme is very dope so i gotta shout out ovo and drake on that color scheme that y'all picked that black and gold and that white and gold scheme that y'all picked y'all did a good job on um, Selecting those two colors, cause that 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 white and gold on those twelves, they nice, very very nice. But we gonna move on to my. Now this is the shoe that I really and um <laughs> and another shoe that I wasn't able to cop because they sold out so fast. They sold out so fast when they first dropped. Are the True Boo 3s <laughs> and the Metallic 5s? <laughs> These are OG shoes and they just sold out so fast I wasn't able to make my payment through PayPal. got me choking. Oh, I'm petty as fuck. Uh, petty wop. <laughs> fuck them true blues. Fuck them attack fives. I'm still waiting for them to go on sale. And I, I have seen pictures of them go on sale. But anyway, let's get back to the original video. <laughs> I really wanted this shoe, man. I'm mad to this day I was not able to check out on the Nike app, man, because I, I was I was waiting by my phone. 859. The shoe drops at 9 o'clock. I'm scrolling, I'm scrolling. Refresh, refresh, refresh. 9 o'clock's pop. Come on, add to court, size 11. Damn, sold out. Next color, size 11. Damn, sold out. Next color, size 11. Damn, sold out. Bruh, this shoe sold out probably like in 10 seconds because I swear, I promise, right hand to the man. At 9 o'clock, I was swiping through, trying to log in, get my side bow, gone. Eventually, uh. <laughs> Damn, my uh, camera just died on me. Well, it didn't die, it just. I guess overheated because I was talking too late damn long. But like I was saying, man, um, by the time I got through and logged in and everything and tried to get my shoe size, they were gone, cuz all gone. Man, I was so pissed off because I really love, love this shoe. Like this is my top shoe that I took the L on that I wish, I wish, I wish I had in my collection, man. What am I talking about? The Air Force One Special Field. Man, I really love, love this shoe, man. Whoever came up with this concept at Nike, man, you smart. You a genius. Like, this whole concept is dope. Man, these are fire. Flames, man! Like I really love high top shoes, and this shoe and the theme behind it and the concept is just dope, man. Like I love all the colorways. I love the brown one. I love the green one. I love the black one. I love the white one. I love all of them, man. But the one that I was really checking for were the green ones, the brown ones, and the black ones. And the white ones. 
Like, <laughs> I seriously wanted any of those. Like, the green ones is definitely, definitely, definitely dope. I feel like you can wear that shoe with anything. Definitely a dope fall time, spring, winter shoe, man, because that green, I don't know. I just, I just, I just love this whole concept with the belts on the top. It, it, it kind of reminds me of like a, you know, like with those heavy metal people, how they be dressing. Like that kind of, it's like kind of like that, but a cool stylish Air Force One. Then it has the, you know, the the the, the hardware material of the, uh, you know, of the Air Force of people in the army, and you know how they have those two belts at the top, and then just the rugged and raw materials that they used on these. And I think these came with like, uh, like a bag or something like that. Like this whole, I mean, these are just dope man so i'm very 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 sad very disappointed that i was not able to cop these like i said i was trying to cop any any color any color the black with that gum bottom is crazy these green with the gum bottom is stupid that brown is just fucking bipolar and that white is just fucking handicapped. Like, just short yellow school bus, just special. You know what I'm saying? This is a short yellow school bus special, handicapped, parking in front of the store type special, man. So, whoever was able to cop these, man, salute to y'all because I'm definitely jealous, man. But anyway, man, I just ran down, I think I ran down 30 pairs of shoes. I don't know how many shoes I just listed. I'm sure the number would be up here somewhere. And these are the shoes that I took the L in in 2016, man. So, hopefully in 2017, I will be able to come across these shoes for retail or just a little bit over retail or maybe a little bit under retail who knows but you just gotta be patient in this sneaker game if you wasn't able to cop when they release hey man don't trip they might restock later on you just you know gotta have your phone on you you gotta be on the internet and you gotta be ready to you know just fucking always gotta be ready because they always do restocks on these shoes so you know anyway that's about it, man. I hope y'all enjoyed this video, man. I kept it raw, rugged, and, 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 and uncut. If I messed up, I don't give a fuck. But you know what I'm saying? I just I just want to show y'all that I could do this in one take Jake, baby. One take Jake. I'm, I'm getting pretty good at this shit. So anyway, make sure you comment, like, subscribe. Make sure you subscribe to me if this is your first time. Hit that like button for your boy. Hit that like button, man. I, I've been talking for like 30 minutes and I'm done talking, man. All right, I'm out. I need some goddamn water. Oh, shit.